to our digital dive this morning. Minnesota's attorney general is suing six bars in our state to, pre to prevent them from Jeez. illegally reopening their bars today. So we're asking you guys, do you agree with this? Should the state be stepping in to stop them? We'd love to hear from you. You can weigh in right now by using the CARE 11 mobile app to vote. Meanwhile, Minnesota Attorney General Keith Ellison announced he's suing six bars and restaurants known as Shady's. The owners are planning to open today, which would be a violation of the governor's Stay Safe Minnesota order. According to an emotional Facebook post from the restaurant owner, a lawsuit from the state would be very expensive, even crippling, but it's not stopping them. We got bad news. We got bad news yesterday at about 4.30, 4.45, the attorney general called me and let me know that if we open, we will be given a $25,000 fine per location, per occurrence. Yeah, the owners say they want to take this all the way to the Supreme Court and even have a GoFundMe started, which is at more than $170,000 and counting. Because of the thousands of people donating in a more recent Facebook post just posted last night, the owners announced that their Albany location will open later today at noon with proper safety precautions in place. The Attorney General, however, is not backing down either. In his statement, he says the owner of Shady's, quote, has declared his intention to break the law and endanger his customers and employees. In Stearns County, with the second highest number of COVID-19 cases in Minnesota, my office has the duty to enforce the law and the governor's order to protect Minnesotans' health and to protect businesses that are complying with that order from unfair competition. I take that duty seriously. Now, this is the first enforcement that we've seen from the attorney general who seems to be using Shady's Bar and Grill as an example for other restaurants to stay closed so they don't also see a lawsuit from the attorney general. Um, but again, from the looks of it, this fight is just getting started because they have well surpassed their GoFundMe money to get that lawyer to help them with this fight. So it should be interesting how this all unfolds. Again, we'd love to hear from you, your thoughts on this whole situation. You can text us 763-797-7250. We'll read your comments coming up in just a little bit. Right now, Sunrise, there's pretty much split right down the middle, 51% saying yes. So it's a close one. Thanks, Alicia. And we're